What's going on guys? Bringing you guys the week 6 picks. Got your new camera looking good. And there's a lot of close games this week, so I'm going to get right to it. Uh, here we go. So I'm bringing you guys the week 6 picks. I'm going to get right to it. Carolina at Atlanta. Um, right off the bat, I'm going to say Atlanta. They're great at home. I know they lost against the Packers last week, but I think they're going to rebound, and uh, I, I see them going 3-3 three and three this week. Um, Indy at Cincy, I believe this is actually going to be a close game, even though they're kind of, uh, you know, kind of... Actually, Cincinnati's at 3-2, and two, but I'm going to pick Indianapolis to get their first win this week. No team's going to go on to, uh, with, without a win this season, so I'm going to, I'm going to take Indy uh, to upset Cincy. Uh, San Francisco at Detroit, this is the game that um, I could not decide on. I went back and forth. San Francisco looked great against Philadelphia, uh, you know, in Philadelphia. Then Detroit looked great. They're 5-0. and oh. um, I'm taking Detroit Lions to go 6-0 and this week. St. Louis at Green Bay, no-brainer Green Bay. St. Louis is way too injury-riddled, and they just haven't been looking good. But they do have Steven Jackson coming into town, but I don't think it's going to be enough. Green Bay wins at home. Buffalo at New York Giants. Uh, this was another tough one for me. Um, I went back and forth with it, but I'm going to take the New York Giants at home. I think they're going to bounce back to a tough loss they took to the Seattle Seahawks, and uh, I have them getting a win this week. Uh, Jacksonville at Pittsburgh. This was not a this was not a hard decision for me to make. Pittsburgh Steelers are going to beat the Jacksonville Jaguars this week. Um, they just gotta they just gotta for the Jacksonville Jaguars to have any chance they gotta run uh, Maurice Jones Drew down the Steelers defense throat. Uh, other than that, I see Pittsburgh winning that game. Philadelphia Washington. Um, my previous video says it all. I'm going to go with Washington. I've gone with Philadelphia the last five weeks, and it just has not looked good for me. I'm 1-4 I'm on the Philadelphia bandwagon. So I'm going to take Washington Redskins to beat the uh, Philadelphia Eagles uh, in D.C. Um, another close game here, Houston Texans at the Baltimore Ravens. Um, this was tough for me to choose. I went back and forth with it, but since Baltimore's at home, since Houston does not have Mario Williams in the lineup, since they don't have Andre Johnson in the lineup, I'm going to go with the Baltimore Ravens. Cleveland at Oakland, uh, I'm taking Oakland. Their, run, their, their running offense is, is one of the best in the league right now, and I don't think the Cleveland defense is going to be able to stop it. So uh, I'm going to take Oakland at home. Uh, Dallas at New England, another close game. I'm going to go New England at New England at home. They're, they're, they're great at home. Tom Brady rarely loses at home. Uh, I'm going to take New England. Sorry, Tony Romo. I don't see you doing it this week. New the New Orleans Saints at Tampa Bay. Tampa Bay looked god awful last week against the the San Francisco 49ers. Um, I just don't see them getting it done against the New Orleans Saints, who's probably the second best team in the NFC right now, behind the Green Bay Packers. So I'm gonna say New Orleans beats them in Tampa Bay. Uh, you got Minnesota at Chicago. This is gonna be a close game, in my honest opinion. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Minnesota's lost a lot of close games this season. Chicago's kind of looked good against some teams, looked bad against other teams. But since Chicago's at home, I'm going to give them the advantage. I'm going to go Chicago Bears beat the Minnesota Vikings. Last game of the season, or last game of the season, last game of the week, Miami uh, Dolphins at the New York Jets. Um, I know you Dolphins fans have been saying suck for luck. Uh, I think you're going to suck for luck, man, because the Jets, I think, are going to win at home. They're going to beat the Miami Dolphins this week. Um... I think San Antonio Holmes, even though there's gonna there's been a bunch of talk about him, you know, in the locker room and whatnot, I think he has a big game this week. We'll see what happens. The O line for the Jets has to protect Sanchez. If they do that, I think they win the game. Those are my picks for week six. I appreciate you guys watching the video. I'm out. <laughs>